it going? Welcome back. Um, after tonight, I won't be streaming for a little bit due to the Happy New Year, everybody. But uh, I did not get the chance to stream Life is Strange on Tuesday this week. Um, and I've been going episode by episode, so I didn't want to leave you guys hanging this week. So um, I'm going to do episode 3 tonight. Um, and if you missed uh, the other two episodes, they're up on my YouTube. My YouTube is linked to my Twitch channel, so feel free to stay involved that way because the VODs do not stay up forever. Um, highlights and stuff do, but um, VODs, they just do not. Uh, even though I'm affiliate, I could probably change that, but they're all on my YouTube anyway, um, so you can catch the content that way. But anyway... Let's uh, jump right into episode 3. As soon as I click it, it's going to give you a recap, so I am going to be quiet during that time. If it ever loads. <laughs> Previously, on Life is Strange Before the Storm. I felt like my dad's been lying about something for a while. I just, I didn't know what it was. There is plenty of blame to go around. What does that mean? You forced my hand. This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. We both agree the change is for me to move in. In a million years, I never thought you'd choose David over me. Hey! Blackwell's well, done with me. Yeah, he's a big Can't jerk. Go home anymore. Is this junkyard all I've got left? Drew runs Oxy for Damon. Go to Drew's room, find the money, and I'll meet you to pick it up. Whatever you do, don't open the door. Oh, I want my fucking money! Juliet is waylaid. That infernal inferno is the culprit, closing down the roads and robbing us of our aerial. No fucking chance. I swear to thee, we shall fly beyond this isle. The corners of the world are mere prologue. What sayest thou to my most hopeful wish? Yes. That's my favorite part Let's of the whole game is the, the play scene. For real. If you don't mean this, it's it's just making me feel like shit that this life you're describing isn't going to happen. What would it take to convince you? Why can't you just tell me the fucking truth? Rachel, that woman you saw, that wasn't my mistress. That was your mother. We left out a pretty crazy cliffhanger last time. <laughs> That's pretty much why I didn't want to keep you guys waiting. It was a big episode. A lot going on. I want to tell you all of it. But are you sure that Chloe should be here for- Chloe stays. Oh. Love that. Of course. In every way that matters, Rose is my wife and your mother, but the woman you saw at the Overlook, her name is Sarah. We knew your that, we knew that. Birth mother. Oh my gosh, this is so much to take in. I'm going to tell you everything, Rachel. Everything I've shielded you from. For so Man, long. this is heavy. But the truth can be hard to look at. Is this really something you're ready for? Well, fuck, does she really have a choice? I mean, it's her truth. She's gotta live her truth. Chloe. can handle this. You can handle this. She knows you're here. Not without you. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Don't worry. I got you. Man! <laughs> Already making the wrong decision. What? Two seconds into the gameplay. I didn't even get to move yet. My first 
ever action in this episode. Damn it. When I was in high school, there was one person everyone adored. Wow, she really does look her like teachers, Rachel. Her friends. <laughs> That's what the dad looked like. Sarah was everyone's favorite. Every boy wanted to date her. I could well, it makes sense because it's Rachel's mom, so. She picked me. Sometimes, I think that's what kept me blind for so long. Let's see. She was so alive, so passionate about everything. Early on, though, I realized. I wasn't enough for her. While the rest of us were pursuing college, careers, families, Sarah wasn't looking for any of that. Hmm. She was looking for escape. Um. Okay. When Sarah became pregnant, I thought it would solve everything. And it did. She's so while. cute. So cute. Becoming your father was the greatest moment of my life. There was so much love, but I was still blind. It's about to get deep, I feel. However much she loved you then, it wasn't enough. For Sarah, the need to escape was always there. Warning right here. I feel like this gets really deep, so trigger warning right now. believe that she was still a good person that no matter what happened she would never I wasn't sure what the trigger warning was gonna be I couldn't remember I haven't played this game in so long but hopefully that was enough of a warning for you guys sorry if it wasn't I was wrong Eventually, I saw her for who she really was, a destructive person, someone who could never be satisfied with anyone or anything, even the love of her own daughter. I was desperate. I didn't know what to do. What so a brave I guy. I was never going to let her harm you again. So what's she doing here though? Guess we'll find out. What you saw at the overlook, Rachel. It was true, we kissed the saddest kiss of my life. It was a kiss goodbye. I told her that I was happy for her. That she felt like she'd gotten her life together. Finally. But she didn't get to just decide one day to be a mother. True. Not after what she'd done. Not after all. What a brave guy. Happy. Maybe he's not such an asshole after all. Well, he kind of is, but... All the lives she destroyed. I told her she'd been given the greatest gift in the world. The chance to be your mother. And she squandered it. Yeah, she blew it. Sorry, bro. It pained me to hurt her like that. But I'd do it again, and again, and again, 
to keep you safe. Wow. That was a lot. Glad we were glad we were here for that. So that was the first time you've seen her or spoken with her in 15 years? No. I send her money every single month. It's our arrangement. But now Fuck that. she wants to see me? Yes. But Rachel, it cannot be. Oh, I don't like either of these decisions. Um, I would say why not, but he'd be like, bro, I literally just explained it. How about, this is going to sound so shitty, but. You think you have the right to decide that for her? I don't feel like when we have I the right to Sarah, say anything. When I took Rachel away, I truly believe I saved her life. And I will continue to protect her no matter what. But maybe she's different now. I mean, people change, right? They don't understand. Maybe so. But consider that for 15 years, she's preferred that money to you. Rachel. True. I think I need to lie down. <laughs> Chloe's like, bro, I don't even know what to do right now. I would go home. I know she doesn't want to go home, but... Fuck, I would just go home. I don't know what to do. I'd be so awkward. <laughs> She's just standing there. I don't know. Their table's all smashed. Shit really hit the fan. Um, where are you guys? We're at the Tempest cast party. Uh, <laughs> we got some shit going down. Wow, everybody is just really being so nice. And it's sad that Chloe can't enjoy these moments, too. Like, I know she's trying to be there for a friend, but good shit's happening in her life, too. But now it's just sad. I feel bad for Chloe. I, I can't leave Rachel to do. wonder what James is thinking right now. Maybe we should talk to him. <sighs> Um, this must be hard for you, too, Master Amber. It could be far worse. My biggest fear is that Rachel will try to meet Sarah. <laughs> I dreaded it. So that's why you never told her? You have no idea what pain Sarah's caused. Yeah, we've her only known Rachel for like a couple has days. Her to do terrible things. I don't want Rachel to go through any of that. What are you afraid of? I I don't understand. Are you afraid that Sarah would do something to Rachel? I don't think she would deliberately harm anyone. But addicts can cause tremendous harm without meaning to. Yeah. But Rachel's not Bro, a Bro, just shut suffering. up. Sarah brought criminals and drug dealers into our home. She put Rachel in serious danger just to chase her habit. Do you think Sarah is involved with any of the drug dealers around here? She is, it bro. It would surprise me if she were. We saw her with That's Frank. That's who she is. Chloe, I believe Rachel trusts you more than anyone else right now. Is this where you ask me to manipulate Rachel into doing bro. what you want? Stop this is it. Where I ask you to do as your conscience dictates. But please, put my daughter's safety first. I will. That is something I will always do. She's so young. You are too. But I know you've experienced loss. Protect her. See, he's being so genuine. I, I can't not listen to him right now. I'll do what I can. I care about her too, you know? I know. Thank you. We gotta we gotta pull through. Wonder what the mom's thinking. Or the mom? Uh, Rose? Uh 
Rose, sorry. Mom, sorry. You okay, baby girl? Hey, Mrs. Amber. We're just like helping I everybody. Think We're like, it's hey. Rose at this point, considering everything. Okay, Rose. Do you need help? Sorry about tonight. Sorry about tonight. Yeah. <laughs> Do you need help with the plates? <laughs> Sorry that tonight turned out so uh, differently. That's all right. I'm really quite glad that you're here. What the fuck? Why? Why? That's weird. Thanks. But why? While Rachel's dealing with all of this, it's a relief to know she can talk oh, to Oh, I you. guess. How I was like, bro. Doing, how am Shit, I, doing? I don't know, bro. Our generation loves to talk about how awkward different things are. Well, this must be pretty awkward, I'd imagine. <laughs> you got no idea. Yeah, it's super weird or doing better than us. Yeah, it's super I weird. I guess I'm not great. Rachel and I were really happy a few hours ago, and now... Maybe you can see why James wanted to keep this a secret. There are many painful things about Rachel's past, including my own role in hiding the truth. Uh, what is that? I mean, not really. Fuck her. Sam I don't know. shouldn't have taken money over seeing her daughter. You know, I am so thankful to her that she did. True, I guess. She gave me the opportunity to be Rachel's mother. That's so sweet. I love I Rose. Never knew how much She's I never been nothing someone. but nice. She's always so Until nice. I had Rachel. But hearing the truth after all these years hurt Rachel more than anything. I'm not happy with James for the whole way this came out. You're <laughs> the not fucking table's just wrecked. James? What about what he did at the Overlook? Bro. It might be hard for you to understand, but after 13 years of marriage, I'm not threatened by what happened. You're Look right. at her. Confident in herself. Confident understand. in her relationship. What a you queen. You don't have to worry about me. Or James. Rachel's the one who needs you right now. Do you think Sarah is dangerous? I've never met her, so I don't know. But I'm inclined to trust my husband. Facts. His entire life is about keeping people safe. Rachel's extremely fortunate to have him as her father. <sighs> Thanks. Thank you, Chloe. I love Rose. Look at her. A confident queen. She's doing the most for this family. Everybody's stressed. Let's go. Let's go figure this out. Bro, we never even been upstairs in this house. Which one is her bedroom, bro? I hope we don't have to figure that out. <laughs> Oh, good. All right. I like her room, though. It's really cool. Real spacey. I love space. What an intro. <laughs> I'm so happy. Uh, what about right now, bro? Her room is really cool, though. Rachel? Hell truly is empty. And all the devils are here. Quote, unquote. Mr. William Shakespeare. I need some way to show Rachel that I'm here for her. Um, there's a duffel bag. <laughs> What's the this yin say? and hadass yang of Rachel Amber. Fuck, I can't see. Rachel has so many inspirations, she can barely keep them all contained. True. I like to look at stuff to Rachel's see. Rachel's surrounded by so much love, yet she seems so... Uh, 
alone. It makes so sense sad. that Rachel needs two signs to contain her awesomeness. I shall call her Lion Crab from now on. You know, they're kind of the opposites where she doesn't feel any of the love and she Rachel feels alone, but dinky she feels all the love and is so alone. Like, I don't know, there's just, I don't know, there's got to be a good balance. This light needs more light. Okay, we can do that. We can figure it out. I wonder what I could find around here to brighten up that night. Rachel's really into stars. <laughs> I wonder if it's her way of feeling connected. Even you, Willie, couldn't come up with the tragedy Rachel's going through. Good old William Shakespeare. Oh. <laughs> Let's look through her. I know computer. something this Arcadia doesn't. Holy. There's a lot going Weird. on. Talking about the fire, graffiti, her planet. I think Rachel could use another subject. But which one? Academy could be funny. That's the one. What does it say? Oh, shit. Hard to believe the show was only a few hours ago. Seems like everything has changed since then. Yeah, holy. I bet Rachel could have any study partner she wanted. Where do babies come from, show and tell? That's funny. I bet Rachel could have any study partner she wanted. Facts. Let's save these. Try to brighten up the room a little or something. At least she'll have something from tonight. Yeah, cause tonight was good. Just you know, sad, some some bad shit may have happened, but we can we can bounce back. What do we got in here? Probably a flashlight or something. Oh yeah, sweet. Give me that. Give me that shit. Oh, shit. Is there a section on how to walk fours through batshit crazy family drama? No? Um, perhaps not. Alright, let's check this out. Uh, wow, she has totally been texting us. Um, oh, we are already here. Um, Leave the door unlocked in case you don't have the key. Come home. Doesn't matter. Oh my gosh. I feel so bad. Um. Anyway, if you guys want to catch up on some of the journal pages. I think we left off on 12. So, let's go. 13. 14. 15. 16. And 20. So, if you guys want to check that out later, you can pause um, uh, in the VODs later or if you watch uh, my YouTube. Because it would be super duper I've heard that long to read all those. Out sometimes, but it still seems hard to believe. Yeah, facts. I like how she just casually has like a giant emergency kit in her bedroom. <laughs> just casual, just hanging out. All ready for Rachel's light show. Better get her attention first. I can't imagine what Rachel is thinking right now. I want her to tell me when she's ready. 
for sure. Let's, uh... Yeah, she obviously does not want to talk, but this little, little act of service will probably be really nice. She'll appreciate it, just sitting there, you know, chilling. Hey, check it out. It's beautiful. I thought you might like it. I've always loved stars. Why? You remind us there's so much beauty out there. Which we almost never see. True. Because we're blinded by what's in front of us. <laughs> exactly. But then I learned the truth. The stars we're seeing have already been dead. I mean, yeah, it's a little sad, years. but they're so pretty, you know. They're all lies. Oh, shit. Um, still beautiful. But Don't worry. That doesn't make them any less beautiful. Right? I don't know. If they're not even real, then what's the point? They're real, bro. You can see them. <laughs> it's all lies. Everything. <laughs> My entire life my dad, <laughs> my mom, if I can even call her that anymore. And yeah, life, woman, life is strange. Uh -huh. my mom. She's the biggest lie of all. I can't trust any of them. Yeah, that's hard. I think you're the only one in the world I can trust. Don't say maybe. Jeez, that would <laughs> not be cool. Even if it's only by process of elimination. <laughs> Good. I wore this bracelet my entire life. I never even asked why. Never even thought about it. <laughs> Somehow, I think I always knew. Even when I didn't know. Maybe it's best we took the bracelet. My real mother was gone. Because it gives it new you meaning, it you know? Oh, no. shit. There's nowhere else I'd rather keep it than me. Oh, she's so nice. We'll vibe here for a sec. Get a nice cinematic view of her room. The fact that she's here right now she came here for me I think I need to see her is that wrong um I don't know honestly I have no idea what's right or wrong in this situation I just know that whatever you decide, I'm in. But what if we can't find her? It's not like I can ask my dad. I have no idea where to start. Um, I've got an idea. I think I know what to do. I'll call Frank and get him to connect us to her. You do that? I'll give it a shot. 
Of course, even if we know where she is, we need a way to get to her. I can't just ask my parents for a ride. Um, I think I can handle that. I think I might be able to fix up that truck in the junkyard. <laughs> really? I'll give it my best. <laughs> I know you will. But even if we find her, how will I talk to her? What do I say? Um, you'll know when After you get there. My dad died. I was worried I wouldn't know how to talk to him anymore. But somehow, when we speak, I always know what to say. When you speak? In my dreams. He's there, and it's so real. It's almost like it's another part of my life. It used to be the only part that mattered. I've never told anyone about that. Weird, huh? Uh, Rachel? I was just thinking... Hello? Maybe I was wrong before. <laughs> Who cares if the stars are dead? As long as we can still see them? That means they're real. She just zoned out. We just told Us. you some important shit in our life. Right? Right. It just feels so sad that we opened up to her and she didn't say anything. Come on, bro. Are we having another dream? I really like this song, even though it's kind of creepy in some of these <laughs> scenes. stuck. Hey, maybe you should let me drive. You always do it wrong. That was one time. When are you going to let it go? Um, bro. <laughs> this is so weird. Oh my gosh. Together. Those are some <gasps> of my favorite memories. David, oh my gosh. Your memories? You never. That wasn't you. Hmm. Could have sworn that was me. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh my gosh. All right, you win. Why don't you go take a look? You sure? Oh my gosh, this is super weird. What is going on? These dream sequences are so crazy. <laughs> With some Twin Peaks type of shit. Ugh. What's wrong? Don't you see anything? Here it is. Fine. It's spark plug no that's not it i just had that replaced isn't improv supposed to be all about yes and yes and what oh my gosh this is weird dad stop N none of this is real you're not real R rachel's family isn't Real. This whole thing, it, it's, it's all just theater. Oh my gosh, this interaction is giving well, me chills. 
You know what William Shakespeare said? Uh, the world's a stage? Something about the whole world being a stage. So, might as well act the fuck out of it. Nailed it. But I don't uh, yeah, want to be an actor. I just want to be myself. Oh my gosh, this is so weird. <laughs> hmm. Well, maybe there's a reason we pretend. Maybe the lies we tell each other are less horrible than the truths we keep hidden. Yo. I was just about to say. Dark, <laughs> Dad. Where do you think you get it from? There's my cue. Dad. Oh my gosh. Relax. No. It's all pretend, right? Right. Just a bit of stage magic. Floodlights. Sound effects. Chloe. No way. Look at me. No way. Look no way. Side. No way. It's going to be okay. Uh, uh, what the? <laughs> oh my gosh. That was intense. That was intense. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That was a lot. This might be the worst one. This might be... Who the f- <laughs> A little comic relief. That was the- I think that was the worst one so far. I don't know. It's between that and the one where the bird is picking at his face. I don't know which one's worse, if I'm completely honest. They're both pretty equally disturbing, but that one might have taken the cake. Oh, she's back home. Okay. Okay. Respect. I saw Sarah leaving Frank's RV. Oh my gosh, no. we're still on this. Okay. He might also be totally pissed about Damon's money. I've got to get this exactly right. I can do this. Oh, we we have the money though, so it's okay. Oh, Frank. <laughs> Eager much? Where's the money? I can't read the first one. Uh, we got Jeez, it. Jeez, would you relax? I have it with me, okay? I'm coming to get it right now. I have a favor to ask you. You can't be fucking serious. I need to find that woman from yesterday. Sarah. Frank. How come nobody answers her right away? <laughs> important. Can you help? Um, it would mean a lot to me. I would really appreciate it. I'm your favorite client, remember? I'll be in the junkyard in two hours. Just bring the fucking money. Yeah, yeah, we got it. Thanks, man. You were real. That went well, I guess. As good as it could. What am I getting myself into? Yeah, I don't know, bro. You gotta just stay home, take a nap, take a bubble bath, and relax, I guess? I don't know. This is getting a little too deep. Oh, fuck. Thank you for being me, yeah. Guess what? Oh my gosh, this is just too much. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I've got two hours to kill. I'm about to rack up a lot more absences. Yikes. Hey, at least you got some C's in there. Inaccurate Not bad. As of yesterday. Someone should update this photo. What do I want the record to show? Burnout. In a good way or a bad way, though. The 
sudden and mysterious absence of Chloe Price. <laughs> Not so mysterious, but okay. Figures. Uh, okay. Um, what? A photo? Nice to see my work is appreciated. Oh, bathroom <laughs> pictures. Layer of nuance. <laughs> Nathan almost pissed himself. <laughs> Worthy of mention, yeah, yeah sure. An idiot. Whoa. Skips in a band? Yo, nice. What a homie. So much has changed. I wonder if you'd even recognize me now. Probs not. Low key. Water? Oh shit. Have we supposed to have been doing this the whole time? Uh, better than nothing. Oh, Mountain Dew. Probably should change clothes, but I guess not. Huh? Mom usually does my laundry when she gets sick of me not doing Bro, my she's laundry. sick of you in general. Maybe she believed me for once about never coming back home. Probably, dude. If Rachel and I were still leaving today, there's literally nothing in there that's worth taking. Well, that's nice. 10 out of 10. Alright, let's get out of here. Is mom playing music? Bro, she moved on without <laughs> you. <laughs> Sorry. You skipped town, so I was right. What? Get every line of that. Oh, oh. You get every line of that play. Fuck! Can I read this, bro? <laughs> I hate when that happens. It won't let me read it. I can't read that fast, dude. How could that be? You've been planning this. Oh no, you've got it figured out. You've, I've had it with the school. Nobody gave a shit about me last night. Bro, because you weren't even in the play. <laughs> I don't know why I'm telling you this. Because you're alone and regret being a bitch to me. That's not. How dare you? Is that David's towel? Where the hell is mine? What? Well, you know, I just want to know why she's so surprised. My towel's probably. No awesome pirate towel. Yo, he really said I'm moving in though. <sighs> Score. Can't believe Max and I were so into this shit when we were kids. Wait a minute. Captain Bluebeard's hair dye. Max was going to make me a pirate. And here <laughs> is the birth. <laughs> the best shower of my life. Of Chloe Price. Hot water. Oh shit. Don't let me down. Alright, never mind. Not right now. Well, I guess we're taking a shower. This music is super vibey though. I'm digging it. Oh, well, there it goes. Oh. The mom's probably like, bro, who is in the shower? Yep, there she goes with the hair dye.
pretty sweet. I kind of like it though. I love her with blue hair. I like it when it's like this. I don't know. Something about the, I like the full head too, but something about like this little bit of it is really cool. What is she doing? Chloe Price we know from the first game. What do I feel like wondering on this crazy ass day? Hmm. Um, we'll do the skull. It's pretty cool. Pretty badass. Definitely a rain, rain, Rachel Amber type outfit. We'll right. go with it. One last thing. I need to get Dad's tools so I can fix that truck. Dad's toolbox should be in the garage downstairs. Yeah, it's not like David really cares about it. Dad's favorite jacket. Definitely taking that if Rachel and I ever. All right, now we're vibing. Oh boy. Here goes. What are the chances I can avoid mom or David? Uh, probably zero percent, but you know. We'll see what happens. We'll roll the dice. I'm flipping them over. <laughs> Not yet, I told you. Three minutes each side. They're gonna burn. Oh, you're the expert now. I can't stand it. It's kind of interesting you, make seeing mess. him in like a, <laughs> a happy and like sweet light. <laughs> it's different. No, you don't have to make and I know the mess. situation is really hard, but... I'd settle for flowers. You cook all you the know. time. I want you to have a break at home. <laughs> you are one class act, David Madsen. See, he's really nice to her. <laughs> Mom actually looks pretty happy right now. Gotta appreciate it. They're vibing. Now we better ruin it, I guess. Aw, it's nice to see her happy at least. Oh, here we go. <laughs> hey, who's there? Hey. Chloe, your hair. When did you... Was this for the play? I heard you performed last night. She's no? so sweet. I mean, I, I did, but this is, uh, is something different. None of that matters now. Oh, I am so glad to see you. Good to see you, Chloe. See why he's home. he gotta be so a smart decision. So like stern. Uh, let's see. I'm I'm not staying long. Just <laughs> picking up some. See stuff. why he gotta be like that? Oh. Are you Fuck. Coming home tonight, Mom. We just come home and make everybody I sad. I wish you would tell me what you're up to. Um, tell her. I'm, I guess. I'm just hanging out with Rachel. Oh, how is Rachel? I was telling David about the play, and you see, she's it. so happy that we're like telling her stuff I for once. Really, gotta go, bro. Listen, wait. Before you go, David has something to say to you. It won't take but a minute. 
I'm fine. I'm fine. Mom. Come on, girl. Chloe. I. Uh, I don't have time for this. Now, bro. Hold on a minute. Please. I owe you an apology. Let's hear it. <sighs> Chloe, I should not have. Oh asked my gosh, you this was all yesterday. I forgot about that. <laughs> the last was, episode was just a day. Uh, out of line. And I'm sorry. Just accept it. Okay. Apology accepted. Really? Yeah. Good job. And good job, Mom, for twisting his arm or whatever. Chloe. What? It's great. He listens to you. Can we be done now? Wait. This is so weird. One second. <laughs> Don't go, Chloe. So awkward. So much tension. I've been meaning to show you something. Maybe. I don't know what maybe this now's is. Now's a good time. I don't remember what this is. Oh my gosh, what is this? This. Oh. Is my friend Phil Becker. We served in the same unit. Two tours. Becker was killed near the end of our deployment. Roadside IED. We used to joke about all the trouble we were going to get into once we got back home. But he died. He died, and I didn't. And I think about that fact every damn day the point is I've had my share of grief I know what you're going through damn he's so nice for sharing so that. I guess what I'm saying is I'm here to do what whatever I can to help you get over the loss of your dad that's really nice. Please, I'm begging you. Give David a chance, won't you? Here. Why don't you keep this photo for a little while? Uh, think about what I've said. Man. He's really trying. I'm gonna have to accept it. David looks so young. And this Phil guy, they look close. We gotta keep that Thank safe. You. David. Oh, Chloe. Mom. At I'm least they're so trying. At least they're trying. You both. Mom. I really need to go. Be careful out there, Chloe. That picture is like... I love you, sweetheart. Hardcore. Alright, alright. You better make a copy of that, bro. I don't know. Trusting Chloe with that? I don't know, man. That's really nice of him, though. What? The he's trying. Hell? He might be kind of a jerk, but he's trying now, I guess. Oh, wow, there's a lot going on. It's only been a day, bro. It's only been a day. Books and then get out of here quick. <laughs> What's the matter, David? Don't want any more decorations inside your toolbox? <laughs> Man, it was only a day. He scooted right in.
There's just so much to unpack with like all these characters. <laughs> it's so hard to like, I don't know, make the right decisions almost. Cause you gotta see it from every angle, you know? Come on. She is a strong, independent woman, though. Damn it! Yelch. Better. But still needs a bit more love. I can salvage this beast. I just what need to say? find the right tool Some for fucking thing here. <laughs> Looks like someone tried to patch this thing up. Sometime before I was born. <laughs> At this point, I think that ancient duct tape is better than anything I can do. Better leave it be. Serpentine belt. It's pretty loose. How can I tighten it? You can tighten it by... There should be... Something over here, maybe? The distributor cap looks pretty gross. I need something small to scrape the gunk off the cap. Am I supposed to find these things? Is that, is that the plan? This connection is pretty shaky. I could fix this battery post if I could get a good enough grip on it. We got a wrench. Not helping. Okay, never mind. I lied. This thing seems pretty gunked up. Ooh, not the radiator. I think I should move on to something else. <laughs> uh, okay, well, maybe we can wrench up the old serpentine belt and see. See if we can give her a good twist. <sighs> Much better. Change the fuel filter. Probably could find another one if needed. Or what's wrong with it? This thing is going to the fuck up. Yeah, I might as well get a new one. What are we turning on? Oh, nah. <laughs> I'm I'm good. Nothing doing. Oh, uh, what are we? Oh, we have other shit in the toolbox. Um, let's look at the screwdriver. And what did we have? Battery post. Might scrape that out. Yeah. Give her a good scrape. That should help keep shit distributed. Well, fuck. <laughs> yes. One one problem is fixed, another one came. starts. I don't think the screwdriver will work on the rest. Let's look at the players. And let's fix that battery post. Fixing stuff is fun yet frustrating. There. Fits like a deadly electric glove. Okay. Oh, we can blow out the fuel filter. Probably should just get a new one, but you know. Maybe. <laughs> Rad. Sick. And let's see what else. Oh, we got the radiator cap. Does not look great, but. We'll see. Spark plugs busted. Carbon deposits. Of course. 
Oh, her dad can help her out. Because he just replaced the spark plugs. Oh my gosh, this is like such a symbolic moment. I'm living for this right now. Oh my gosh, this is so... Oh my gosh! Please? I need you. Whoa! Yeah! She could be a great mechanic. Oh my gosh. Wait, they're 15. Do they have no driver's license? <laughs> hey, what up? What, what, what does that mean? Yeah, what's up? Hey, junkyard queen. Where are you at? She looks like a bad bitch. Hey. Holy oh, shit. Oh, okay. You're I hair. like it. It's so <laughs> badass. <laughs> exactly. Hey, I'm not sure if you saw, but someone moved your truck. No way. You're practically a certified mechanic now. <laughs> Even have the shirt to prove it. Hey, I knew we picked a good shirt. Should we check it out? Duh. Hey, Price. Nice wheels. Thanks, bro. Fixed it myself. You're early, Frank. What's Money, bro. <laughs> Money it's motivates. His oh. Fucking bar mitzvah. Frank here's becoming a man, aren't you, big guy? What's he doing here? What do you think? We're not dealing with a couple of dime bags anymore, Chloe. Where's the money? Here. I ain't, I ain't messing with it. It's right here. Obviously, I was gonna give it to you. You don't have to be such a dick about it. Don't be so cocky, bro. He's a scary dude. You heard what happened to Drew. Right? Maybe We're just like, bro, what is going on? When you talk to me. Whoa, Rachel, Don't Rachel, Rachel. Touch her. Bro, you do not know who you just pushed. Thank you though, but like Why is it that chicks think it's okay to hit me? But if I lay a single finger on them, suddenly, it's a whole other thing. I don't know, bro. Says you were asking about a client of his. That true? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. What's the point of lying? That's true. I don't see why you should give a shit. You don't? Huh. Maybe I'll show you. See, you two Nancy Drews decided it would be a good idea to call your drug dealer and ask about his business. I didn't go to a fancy academy, but that doesn't strike me as smart. 
Maybe it was this man's sunny disposition that confused you. Frank's like, but bro, he's I don't got know. a whole other side to him that I don't think you'd like. Should we let them see it? We're just talking here. <sighs> okay, then let's talk. I want to know right now why you give a shit about this woman. Mm. Not your business, bro. This is between us and Frank. It's none of your fucking business. Problem is, you made it my business. How? And your tough girl shit is starting to get on my nerves. How is this your business, bro? Look, state your business. None of this matters. All we care about is that you stop asking questions. Got it? No. Yo. Tell me where she is now, Rachel. Wait a minute. <laughs> no way. What the fuck is your Rachel? As in Rachel Amber? Oh my gosh. We just gave up that way too much so information, much I feel like. This is James Amber's fucking kid. Damon. Your dad's a real piece of shit, you know. Oh yikes. Who cares, man? So? We don't have anything to do with him. Right. Here's what happens next. Come on, Bro, man. why would you threaten his daughter? No. He's an attorney. This one is the fucking DA's daughter. And right now, she's going to fill me in on what her daddy is up to and how he's connected to that whore everyone's asking about. Damon, calm down. We're still talking. Everything's still cool. Oh, no. Crazy. Oh, my gosh. It just got crazy. It just got crazy. It just got crazy. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I don't know. Fucking bitch. Oh my gosh, it's it's Rachel in the 2 by 4 versus- ah! Oh my god, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh no, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. She's been stabbed. What the fuck? Chloe, go! Now! Why does shit like this always happen? Bro, just get in the truck. I don't even know. She barely works, but- Tie her up. Bro. Come on, dude. Tie her up and we gotta go. Alright, or not. We'll just scoot. Yo, this is intense. I know we should not be messing with this lady. There's nothing I could have done to prevent that, though. I don't think. Uh, I'm not really sure at this point. Talk about a waiting room, right? Oh my gosh. We have to literally look her dad in the eye and be like, yo. Oh my god, we said we were gonna protect her. Fuck. We promised.
Rachel is going to be all right. The knife damaged her brachial artery, but didn't cut it. She's out of surgery, and now she's resting. Chloe, what happened? Uh, it's my fault. Yo, gotta take responsibility. It's my fault. I should have listened to you. Sarah's m mixed up somehow with this psycho Damon Merrick. I know exactly who Damon Merrick is. Yikes. Start over and tell me everything. Did you and Rachel try to contact Sarah? Yeah, dude. I'm not going to chastise or blame you, Chloe. But I need the whole story. We gotta be real. So, I got my dealer to meet us, since he knows Sarah. Frank Bowers. Yeah, that's right. But, Damon showed up with him. What did Merrick want? Um, to ask about Sarah. He asked us why we were so interested in Sarah. And what did you say? No, nothing. Is that how it became violent? Yeah. Um, Rachel got angry. It was, it was actually Rachel who got angry. <laughs> she was curious that he wouldn't tell her where Sarah was. This is exactly what I've been afraid of. Rachel won't let anything stop her. Yeah. She's protecting me too, I guess. Only that. She was already angry about Damon pushing me around. She is like her mother. Quick-tempered, rash. I've always been afraid of losing her the way I lost Sarah. Yeah, I get it. I get it now, bro. What happened next? We saw it firsthand. Damon had a knife out. We all could see it. But then he said something that pissed Rachel off. And she just grabbed a piece of wood and hit him. And then he stabbed her. I keep thinking that maybe I could have done something. Yeah, the the way that the knife dropped when he attacked I feel her, like it was gonna be like a, a decision, but it wasn't. It's not your fault. And Frank held him off so we could get to the truck. I heard a scream. But I don't know what happened. And then He's like, Bro, I don't care about them. I'm just trying to figure out my I daughter. Appreciate you telling me the truth. So what about Damon? What are you going to do about Damon? Find out if he is alive. First of all, my department's been after him for some time. I was told that if Rachel had arrived only a few minutes later, she might not have, um... Oh, man. Don't say that. I don't know. Ah. You <laughs> my world. It will be some time before Rachel wakes up. I promise. I'll let you know when she does. Okay. Thanks. Is that... What's she doing here? Hey. Bro, everybody's in the hospital today. Steph. How's Drew? Pretty good. Miss Amber just told me Rachel's going to be okay. I'm really glad. Yeah. Well, our room's just down the hall. You should come by. Our room, like she's okay. like staying here. Sure. 
Hey, <laughs> I've been sleeping here. Five star service. What up? <laughs> Chris, high five. I don't think I can sit still any longer. Might as well stretch my legs. But... Oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, shit. I know those guys. Uh, this doesn't look like the maternity wing. Uh, there's a sign for the prenatal class. I can't believe we're finally doing this. I'm so excited. <laughs> You're gonna be a good dad. Oh. <laughs> I guess I'm glad we stole their wine. Huh. I guess everything happens for a reason. What up, girl? Not really a whole lot to really look at, so we'll just go straight to the room. Guess we'll talk to him. All right, oh, then. never mind, I lied. Oh, maybe. Thank you. Hi. Mr. North? That's me. And you are? I'm Chloe. You here to see Drew? Yeah. How are things? How are... Uh... How are things going? Oh, you know how it is. Ups and downs. You know, Drew's hurt. Of course. But, uh, I'm between jobs. So, got plenty of time to visit. You know? Yeah. Hold on. You said you were Chloe. Mikey's mentioned you a few times now. I have a question maybe you can answer. Oh boy. Sure. Both of those boys have been acting a little, well, guilty lately. Yeah, I've, I've been spending most of my time looking for work. I'm worried. Oh, bro. I missed something important. You missed some you crazy shit. On, I should probably be honest. He deserves to know. You should probably ask Drew. I, uh, don't really know any details. I do know that whatever it is, they did it because they wanted to help you. Thanks, Chloe. I know they've been trying to help me out, money-wise. We're a family, you know? We deal with things together. Yeah, Excuse sorry, me. bro. At least we're honest, see? Honesty is the best policy, and that is... That's what we're rolling with today. Hey! You made it. Oh. Hey, Chloe. Hey, Drew. Don't make a joke. How is your <laughs> knee doing? Do they think it's gonna heal? Uh... I'm not sure, actually. It's too early to tell. Oh, man. Sorry to hear it. It's it's all good. <laughs> Love the hair, by the way. Pretty cool. Thanks, girl. Thanks, boy. Thanks, everybody. I figured it might fit with my new barbarian look. You know, a war paint. Awesome. Nerds. <laughs> hey, any news about Rachel? Her mom seemed hopeful. Rachel's stable. She'll probably wake up soon. How'd she get hurt? You'll think I'm joking when I tell you, but I'm not. What happened? She got stabbed in the arm by demon fucking Merrick. These poor high school Seriously? kids, bro. It, it wasn't because of me, was it? We have our own problems. No. Somehow we've got our own shit with him now. That's crazy. Fuck that guy. I wish I could get my hands on him. Drew, chill out, okay? Uh, okay, Steph. Uh, I'm headed out. Everything okay in here? Yep. Yeah. 
throwing out too much money now. Steph is like their main spokesperson. Take the appropriate for the hospital. Bye, Dad. See ya, Pops. Man. Maybe... I shouldn't have mentioned Damon. Rachel's gonna Probably be not, soon. but... Uh, he he probably gets it. Head over when I'm ready. Ooh, I want to eat that <laughs> right now. That does look pretty good. I ain't gonna lie. Let's speak to him, I guess. Hey, sorry for losing it there. It's nice of you to come by. Of course. Yeah, no problem. Easier than you coming to me. <laughs> you know what? I'm kind of tired. Oh. Oh, right, right. I'll, um, I'll leave you alone. That was kind of awkward. Yeah, I don't really think there's much to say. I don't really want to talk to them low-key. I will, though. Drew's been in a lot of pain today. Okay, well, alright. <laughs> My bad. Hope hope it's okay, bro. I wonder if Drew will ever play again. Oh, uh, yeah. Look at that. Wells being nice for a change. Yeah. Kind of a first, but we'll take it. We'll take it. Alright. I'm gonna head out. It was really great to see you, Chloe. Agreed. Don't be a stranger, okay? Yeah. Got gotcha. you. Tell Rachel we're rooting for her. You bet. Oh, wow. We didn't even get a choice. Uh, okay. She's up. Uh See, he's he's got the spirit. Just needs a little time. Just heard the fire went out. Oh my gosh, yeah, the fire. Should we talk to to Mama Amber? Hey. Chloe, I can't even express thank you so much. <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm a wreck. I stepped out to get some air. Rachel doesn't need me crying in front of her. Oh. Your hair. I almost didn't notice it. Oh. Yeah. It's... It's not a big deal. I bet Rachel loves it. I can't imagine what I would do if we Oh my lost gosh. Her. Guys, we're sad, okay? Everybody's sad, I know. It's gonna be okay. I'm sure everything's going to be fine. This is a very tense That's episode. What James keeps saying. He's so strong in crisis, you know? M my dad was like that. I'm sure he was. Just like his daughter. We were lucky. I just keep feeling like we were lucky. It could have gone so much worse, you know? I'm sure it would have been if you weren't there for her. I am so glad you and Rachel have found each other. When you meet someone who changes everything, you just know. True. Well, hang in there, Mrs. Amber. I will. Alright. She's always so nice to talk to. I'm having a little bit more faith in the adults in this game. <laughs> that... I'm glad that you're here. Me too, Rachel. It hurts. Shh. 
the pain will pass. Chloe's here. You want me to stay? No. I'll be okay. I'm so glad to hear it. Oh, Dad. later, bro. I'll come back in a little while. <laughs> My guardian angel. Oh my gosh, it just plops down everywhere. <laughs> um, how are you? How are you? Not great. Better with you here. Oh, stop it, stop it. Rachel, I'm sorry. What? What for? You're here because of me. Junkyard. What? Shut up. She's so pale. Oh my gosh. So the way that they designed her to be froze. like, like in pain up. and stuff is like I'm really so good. Sorry. It's not really good that she's in pain, you but saved my life. did a good job designing it. You saved my life. Yeah, don't do that again, bro. Just don't do that again. Play the damsel in distress. <laughs> you got it. No. Attack a Sega with a two by four. <laughs> that was crazy. News flash, Chloe. I'm a little crazy. I know, but that was a little too much. <laughs> Maybe we dial it back a little. Crazy hot. Happy that your dad's here. I mean, I'm still mad at him for everything he's done. But still, your dad. It felt so good to lean on him. He's my dad, you know? I felt completely safe. Like, on Mount Hood. Would you do something for me? Anything. Sarah. Bro. Mom. <laughs> it's so weird to say. I'm not even sure what she is, honestly. But <laughs> I think I still want to meet her. Um, are you sure? <laughs> are you sure? She could be completely different than you imagine. I'm sure. I don't even know if she's still in Arcadia Bay. But if she is... You find her, please. You really want this, don't you? I do, Chloe. I really do. All right. Oh, she stood up. She sat up. She's for real. Then, of course. Whatever it takes. I bet my dad has her number. Oh my gosh. Our house keys just under the mat. The code is zero seven two two. To your your dad's office. Zero seven two two. Yeah. My birthday. I'll find her, Rachel. And then I'll. I'll tell her how fucking cool you are. Oh my gosh, bro. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Thank you, Chloe. We really deep in it. For... 
everything. Uh, oh, Elliot! Uh, hey, Elliot. What is she doing? Hey. Wait. Your hair is different. What do you think? Do you like it? <sighs> yeah. Yeah. I like it. It's uh, it's nice. Why did um the design for high school Mr. Amber look just like him, but with different colored hair? <laughs> Um, nice balloon. Uh, nice balloon. Yeah, Why, I guess. I guess. <laughs> yeah, it's for Drew. Were you, were you just in there? I'm actually here for Rachel. What? Rachel's here? What happened? Um, she's keeping it private. He doesn't I need to know. I think she's keeping that private for now. She's okay, though. Well, that's good. Yeah, I, I guess I'll stop by after I see Drew. She probably wants privacy. Oh. Right. Of course. Are you, are you two in some kind of trouble? You can tell me if you are, you know. Bro, why are you like... Judge. Bro, read the room. Um... Uh, nothing we can't handle. Nothing it's okay. Nothing we can't handle. Chloe. I'm seriously worried about you. Well, don't be. Uh, I mean... You're hanging out with Rachel Amber a lot lately. Right? So? So what? So, yeah. Yeah, so what, bro? What are you trying to say, bro? Obviously, something is going on. What's that supposed to mean? Not your business, it's bro. Really... He really says stuff that it's grinds really my gears sometimes. Your business, Elliot. Okay. That's fair. Just remember I'm here, okay? If you suddenly need something. Thanks. Bro. Anyway. What are you trying to say? I don't like this guy. See you around. Never did. I'm glad we didn't go to the play with See him. See you around, Chloe. Yeah, sure. Twice for good measure. There's just so much weird shit going on. Like, that exchange with Elliot was super awkward. <laughs> oh my gosh, painfully so. Hello? Oh my gosh, we should not be here, bro. We should not be here. Oh my god, I feel so. Oh my gosh, I can't breathe. I need to search this office for any communication with Sarah that can help me find her. Well, let's check out this drawer. 
Oh. Not gonna be able to smash my way through this one. Hopefully there's a key around somewhere. Maybe we'll try this one. Oh. Uh, I don't know if we should graffiti, I guess. Because I want the trophy. <laughs> but my morals tell me this is a terrible idea. <gasps> Bro! Not the desk! Uh, fuck. Uh, it was not worth it. It was not worth it. Best dad. <laughs> that stuff is all politics anyway. Hmm. Huh, something's in there. Something is in there. It's a little sus. Found you. I feel bad about the graffiti now. Hey Chloe, thanks again for visiting. Drew says good luck out there. Okay, Chloe. Oh man, he's so nice. I hope Drew gets better. Welcome to Shadyville. Oh, what is that? Files? Computer? Lockbox? Ah, uh, lockbox, huh? Or shoebox. Just a regular old shoebox? Alright, never mind. Ooh, this is kinda sketchy. Uh, let's look at the phone. I have to know who James is talking to on the secret phone of his. It could you know, be she attacked me first, right? It's Damon. Turns out she's not so easy. We're gonna be. I talked to your girl. She has a big mouth. Oh my gosh. James mm. is working with Damon Merrick? This is insane. What were they talking about? Is the girl Damon's talking about Sarah? <sighs> Whatever is going on, I need to see if Damon knows where Sarah is. But how do I get him to tell me? Uh, let's not threaten him. We should not be talking. The answer's quick, though. Shit. What do I say? You first. Hope James actually has this evidence. Don't think Damon will tell me where Sarah is. Unless I send him a picture. Uh, uh, Arcadia Bay is least wanted. Uh, okay. Let's try this drawer, I guess. I don't know. I don't really see much. This must be what Damon was talking about. Shit. Which of these is Damon talking about? Mm. I could just take a wild guess and see what he says. Or maybe there's some info on the case hanging around the office. Yeah, I'm not really willing to take a risk here. Arcadia Bay's least wanted. Wait. 
Uh, man, this writing is so close together. I kind of hate it. Uh, Merrick, a fire poker, gloves. Reading that made me my brain turned up pancake batter. She is really messing with some shit that she should not be. If I can figure out how. How uh. do I destroy a glove? Maybe I can burn it somehow. Oh my gosh, this is the worst idea of all time. Gosh, this is not a great idea. <laughs> oh, Oof. shit. Better not touch that again. I hope James has something here to tell me who Damon's informant is. Bro, so we should to... not be playing with this. Man. Find which of Damon's Chloe guys is a jerk. Searching. I'm not gonna lie. I should say Arcadia Bay's least. Oh my one. gosh, I did not mean to hit that. Okay. Not Frank. Frank is the homie. If I'm going to accuse one of these guys, I better be sure I'm right. Let's look at the crime report. Um, reporting officer, case number, person described. So it was the lumber yard. Could this douchebag be the snitch Damon's talking about? This guy let me into the mill. Cool dude. I totally knew this guy was a criminal when I, I stole from him. I think so. Guess this explains why Mr. Amber knows so much about Frank. You know what? Could this douchebag. I don't, I don't know. I don't think so. I agree to aid the courts on future cases. That could be seen as a little snitchy. I feel like I should just pick somebody and go with it, I guess. Sarah sent the Sarah uh, in this letter. Doesn't seem If you guys want to read these, like go the ahead. James told us about last night. I will let you guys pause. But we got to figure this shit out. Yes, I'm lucky James keeps so much info at home. Probably I not. I agree to aid the courts on future cases. 
and that could be seen as a little snitchy. But who said that? Gerald Scott is like, is that him? I don't know. Sure. We'll go with him. Where's the phone? Oh, wait. Who is that? I then? totally knew this guy was a criminal. I guess this explains why Mr. Amber knows so much about Frank. Sheldon Thunder Vendor Dude. Bro. I think that's all we kind of have to work with here. Oh. This is that freak from the mill. Wonder what Damon would think of his very cooperative comment. Sheldon. Who's that? Ah, uh, yes. All right, sure. Yeah, whatever. Teach you to mess with me, bro. Payment? Fuck. Mm, how much? He's gonna be like, we discussed the price. Here's hoping James already has Damon's money. <sighs> but where would it be? This, this is too much. It's Even too much. Though James is trying to protect Rachel from her mother. This seems like a pretty terrible way to act. I, I guess. I wonder if this has anything to do with Damon's stash. Let's check it out. We're like basically detectives as well. Detective Chloe. Holy wad. Holy shit. I guess a picture. What are we Snapchatting this guy? <laughs> Just gotta get the right angles. Fuck, that's Sarah. Oh shit. And she's at the mill. What is he doing to her? Uh, I'll be right there, I guess. Holy shit. Does James even know Sheesh. what he's doing? Okay. I think he does. I, time. <laughs> I mean, Do you technically are his forcing hand. his hand. I, I mean... He wouldn't do anything to her. Yeah. I need to get there fast. Chloe? Elliot? Hey. What? Elliot, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? What the heck? This is Rachel's house, right? Did he really just follow me here? You, you followed me, what the? Did you? Did you follow me from the hospital? I did. I'm worried about you. Bro, I do not like this I'm guy. Fine. He gives me the worst you, vibes. The he always crazy. did. You shouldn't be here. Chloe, what is... Uh. <gasps> Whoa, what is going on? Elliot, put that down. You have no idea what you're dealing with. And you do? Chloe, God, what have you gotten what yourself you, into? My Parents? You, you wouldn't understand. Bro, Give this is weird. Chance. What the hell are you doing? Again, it's none of your business. Honestly, Elliot, you, you can judge me all you want, but it's pretty fucked up that you're here right now, and I don't have time for this. When? What? Bro, what are you- When will what? you have time? For me. You have all the time in the world for, for Rachel. I'm so sick of you not seeing who Rachel really is. When will you realize what she's doing to you? Elliot, just take a step back. No. 
Bro, you what is up with me. this guy? What has your relationship with her gotten you? And why does it matter? You, he just you don't jealous, I guess. I don't know. This is not First normal behavior, bro. Out, what happens? You end up in a fight. She saved me. You don't know what you're talking about. Rachel saved my ass. I'm sure that's how it seemed to you. Stop. Stop suggesting that she's somehow bad. The or... next day, she convinces you to skip school. Magically, she barely gets in trouble. And you get suspended. It's my choice, bro. You act like I can't I make my own choices. I wanted to. Rachel tried to protect me. Yet somehow, it all worked out for her in the end. As usual. I mean, understand. he's got a point, but you this is not there. the way to bring this up. Was she up. <laughs> protecting you when she made you take part in a play you didn't want to be in? S seriously, man. Y you need to shut the fuck up before- I've been quiet long enough. Look, Rachel is an amazing- I get it, he cares, and but- I mean on stage. She's fake. You're real. And I hate to see her manipulate you like this. Elliot, I, I promise, n no one is manipulating me. No? Just look where you like, are Like, he's now. got some great points, but this is not the time nor the place. And breaking into houses. Nor the way it's to bring crazy. it up. <sighs> like, Just as easily could have been you in that hospital today. If that ever happened. I appreciate the concern, bro, Look, but... I, I hear you. I, I appreciate the concern. I don't think you do. Jeez. Elliot, I'm the one who cares about you, Chloe. Me, not Rachel. It's time you saw the truth. Bro, what? What does that mean? It means you're going to stop thinking about Rachel and pay attention to me now. Whoa, Run. whoa, hey, whoa, what the fuck? Calm down, bro. Hey, please. I know you're upset. But... I'm not upset. I'm trying to help you. What what? Uh if we call for help, like we Loki broke into her house, so we gotta go. Look, I'm sorry, but I really need to go. Whoa, 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 hey, bro. Why did you make me do that? Can't what? you just listen to me? No. I guess I got another choice. Elliot's gone full blown crazy. I I need to get the police to come without tipping him off. Who was there for you? When Max left? When your dad died? No one else gave a shit about you Yo. except for me. He's crazy. We have a lot to talk about. And I don't care how long it takes. We're not leaving until you see that I'm right. All right, all right, we gotta figure this out. I'm kind of stressed. Oh shit. All right, Elliot. You want to talk so bad? Let's talk. Fuck, we cannot fuck this up. What's really going on here? You can tell me. Exactly. Amber has the DA lives here. The DA lives here. Here's what's going on. We're at the DA's house, and we should probably leave before he comes back. Don't worry. With Rachel in the hospital, we gotta be like secret. Coming anytime soon. I'm talking about your situation. Rachel is dangerous. You need to realize that. You're keeping me here. My life is at risk. I feel certain. You're keeping You're me the here. One who's Fuck! Keeping me here. No! At the Arcadia Bay D. No! James Amber's house. Fuck! You're acting strange. What's going on? 
What? Nothing. I... What are you... Ugh, you bitch! Oh my god. Can't you see? I just want to help you! What is this guy's problem? What's his obsession? Me now? Uh... That's how far you'll go to protect Rachel? This is what I'm talking about. No! You idiot! What the fuck? Better run, dickbag. Cops will be here any minute. Yo. Yo. Uh, I'm surprised that truck can go that fast. <laughs> oh my gosh. She should put it in a bag or something. Oh my god, there's blood stuff. Oh my gosh. Bro. <laughs> Everything about this whole episode is giving me massive anxiety. She just gets out. She's like, I need a minute. That was intense. So much destruction. All because Rachel got angry at her dad. Who's been lying to her all her oh, life. Oh yeah, oh my god. I'm not gonna lie, I keep forgetting so that the fire is happening. Hey, being a dad's tough. That doesn't justify what he's done. I'm just saying. I'd probably do anything to keep you safe. Hey, Dad? Yeah? Did you ever lie to me? I don't mean telling me that ashtray I made for Mom wasn't a piece of crap. <laughs> I mean, like... I don't know if she's ready to hear this. About something... That might hurt me to know. What do you think? Um, I suppose everybody lies. I suppose everyone lies about big things. I mean, the stuff mom doesn't know about me. So you probably lied too. Would you love me less? Honestly, no. Of course not. You sound pretty sure, sweetheart. You were pretty sure Mom would never fall in love with someone like David, too. Are you really ready to hear the answer to your question? Yeah. Ready as I'll ever be. Problem is, I'm dead. Fuck. So how am I supposed to tell you anything? We get so close. We get so close to the answers. But then he pranks us in the end. He's just playing with us at this point. I guess it's better this way. Not knowing. Then I'll always be the perfect dad? How many people get to say that? I miss him. No word. My ride, my tunes. <laughs> oh, this is just. Oh. You 
those moments make my heart melt. Am I seriously going in to face Demon Merrick? All for Rachel? Am I crazy? Hella crazy. I'm <laughs> glad you're here, Dad. You don't want me to go? No. I like the company. Besides, you don't want to miss this. Things are about to get real. For real, though. She rolls up like she owns the place. Maybe she does own the place. Fuck. Shit. I don't know. Is that blood? Oh. That's Frank's RV. This is not really Frank. set in a great mood. Bro, just be quiet. Just be quiet. Do the thing. Just do the thing. Walk away. Walk away, baby girl. Shit, this is bad. I'll get you help, Frank. But first, I've got to help Rachel's mom. Yo, I'd be shitting myself, by the way. Past. Oh, spooky. Maybe we should take this. Yeah. <laughs> Shit's kind of spooky. There's the phone. Look through the cracks. Everything's going to be just fine. Just a little. Oh, I'ma point out another trigger warning really quick. I'm pretty sure it's also drug related. Um, so just another trigger warning. Longer, and all your troubles are going bye bye. What the fuck? I just want to meet my daughter. Can't you understand her? Why does Your he- daughter? <laughs> Jesus. So that's what he's worried about. Can't let the public know that the mother of his daughter is some junkie. I just want to see her. You don't have to- Shut up. James Amber wants you out of the picture. So that's what's going to happen. This is oh, so messed up. I see now. Junkie. No. Oof. He said you've been sober a year. Respect. It's hard to kick this shit. You can do this. I don't even think she knows what she's doing. Well, she doesn't. I know that, but. What the hell are you doing here? I got your money. I got your money right here. The money James owes you? How the fuck do you- Run! No one has to know. Just, just let her go, and I won't say- <sighs> Oh shit. Ah, no. fuck. Talking's over. Leave her alone! Shut up. 
What the fuck? Oh man, I didn't even get a you chance. <laughs> DA shit. Got my money? Burn the evidence? All that? I'm just trying to help. Get away from her. I said shut the fuck up. Oh my gosh. This is not going to plan at all. Go to your fucking happy place. Brian. Let this be a lesson, kid. Make good life choices, or you'll end up like her. Now, what do I do with- Damon! What did you do? Oh, ho, 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 ho. I fucked you up good, didn't I? Guess you really don't know when to quit. Glad to see you back on your- I mean, we, he was just parked Boy. outside, like- <laughs> Mike, We're all just kind of really chilling. do this again, do you? Okay. Then I don't want to do this again. Come on, man. Fuck you. <gasps> Shit. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There's so much happening. Bro, I did not get a single chance to do anything. <laughs> Even after all this, Chloe does not think of herself, man. All this shit is going down. And she just keeps doing shit for Rachel. Elliot had a point, but he was really whack about it. Sarah? Chloe Price. Price is right. You know who I am? I saw you in the play. You were funny. Thanks. Sit. Sarah. Are you okay? We need to talk about what happened. There's a lot more questions to ask than that. I am so... So sorry for Rachel can never know. Know about what? What ex what James did. Hiring that thug. Shooting me up with <sighs> He's a piece of shit. And I promise that Rachel Oh my gosh, I don't even know. Can never know. I don't understand, I guess. Tell me why. Doesn't she deserve to know what her father did? No. Rachel deserves a loving father. A father who cares for her. James is a liar. James <laughs> is a desperate man who loves his daughter. And she loves him. Tell her what happened here. And you'll take that away from her. Forever. Um, she deserves the truth. Don't you think the truth matters more? The truth? What's so great about the truth, Chloe? Why are you saying all this? Because James is right. He's taken something from me that I might not ever get back. But he's right. I'm broken. Everybody's a little Everybody's broken if we have broken. not Sarah. realized that, man. Does everybody abandon their own child for 15 years? Does everybody take money to stay away? You got a point, I guess. You're you got here a point. now. That's what matters. What do you know? I know Rachel needs you. I... No loss. Talk about the I dad. I lost my father two years ago. How? Car accident. 
Wow, he somebody's was, listening to Chloe. <laughs> he was picking up my mother from the grocery store, and a truck ran a red light, and that was it. I'm sorry. See, that's all Chloe needed, honestly. Somebody to listen for five seconds. You don't know what this is to me. Every pain. Every fear. Gone. No more sadness. No more grief. Why would anyone not want to feel that way? Uh... Ever. It's probably not great for your body, but... I read your letter to James. You beat this before. You can beat it again. No. I can't. I, I recognize I might not know what the fuck I'm talking about here, but I just... I wish you, you you're now recognizing that, bro. I know. She's fearless. She's brilliant and talented. And she feels so much. She's so strong. She's had a good life. Raised in a loving home. Given opportunities I could never give her. At least... Talk to her. She's felt like something's been missing her whole life. She told me so. I don't know, man. That something was you. She didn't miss anything. She has a perfect family. I wouldn't say perfect, but... Even without all this shit, the Ambers are far from perfect. Nobody's James perfect. Is I mean, the elitist asshole, and and Rose lets him walk all over her. Maybe. What Rachel needs, though, is not to have her father taken away from her. <laughs> he doesn't it's deserve. It's not about James. It's not about me, and it's not about you. It's about Rachel. Tell her what James did. And you'll be killing him for her. You understand that, don't you? You lost your father. Do you really want to put Rachel through that? She got a good point. Don't you want to see her? Don't you want to see her? I don't like any of these choices, you honestly. For it. You got sober. You deserve the chance to know your daughter. Nothing can change the mistakes I made. I'll never get to be Rachel's mother. Not really. But there's one thing this is so intense. I can still do for her. The only thing I can do. Let me give her the father she deserves. The one who raised her. Yeah, we really messing with something that we should not be, and we should not even be here, but, you know. More than anything. We vibin', we vibin'. <laughs> you can do whatever you want, Chloe. You have the power. What you have to decide is whether you're going to protect Rachel or cause her even more hurt. Yeah, I know living with that has got to be tough, but... So please. Gotta do what you gotta do. Tell her I was never here. Let her have what peace she can without me. Wait. I'll take care of her. I'll take care of her, you know. I believe you. Goodbye, Chloe. Yeah, giving her the bracelet, like, I don't know. 
I just don't feel like that was the right move. Just give her reassurance and, you know, call it a day. She wearing pajamas? Or is that doctor stuff? Or whatever, you know. You know what I'm talking about. Hello? Hi, Chloe. Rachel's just fallen asleep. Bummer. Oh, rats. We just missed her. I know she'll be thrilled to see you when she wakes up. Maybe come back a little later. Hey. Oh. Back she back says, psych. You need your rest. Can I talk to Chloe? Alone? For a minute? Okay, sweetie. We'll be right outside. <laughs> right outside, listening in the door with a little cup. <laughs> How are you feeling? Like I got stabbed? <laughs> <laughs> Doc says there'll be a sick scar. Maybe a tattoo is in order. Fuck yeah. We never actually escaped. Aw, they brought the star thing We've with got the little flashlight. That's kind of nice. All the time in the world. So... How did everything go? Rachel. Uh, <laughs> I've got dot, 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 question mark. Protector, bro. Oh. I knew it from the beginning. That's exactly what I wanted to do. What's wrong? I failed you. I couldn't find her. I'm so sorry. Honey, you seem so confident. I really thought you'd find her. Yeah. Me too. Maybe we can try tomorrow. Maybe she hasn't left town yet. Of course. Oh, I don't know. I know. I don't know about that, bro. Wherever she is. She loves you. Very much. How do you know that? Uh, when you know, you know. Because, why should she be any different from the rest of us? I think this is the end. You know what? I'm glad we hit the truth, though. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> it's good for Rachel, but not good for us, but we'll get over it, I guess. I don't know. I'm glad that Frank's alive. episode holy they're happy at least i guess i'm happy for them on it oh my gosh oh my gosh i'm just as surprised as her oh my 
gosh. <laughs> Just be happy, bro. Come on. Get hyped. Get hyped. Come on. A little smile, a little something. Oh, fuck this guy. I hate it. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, move out of town, bro. I don't even care. He's crazy. I'm glad that they're okay. I hope his leg is okay. They are not together. Okay. I don't know what is happening with that. Okay. Oh, fuck it, Victoria. What, is she jealous of him? Like... Aww. Chill out, Wells. He's like, I'm never letting her back in this school, bro. The raven will always be there. Such a sweet ending. I don't know if this is the end of the game or not, though. I feel like it is. Oh, she's even at her house. Full blue. See, things are good. Things are good. And the, I know Joyce will love it. And their little hideout at the junkyard. When they wrote the names, we saw that in the in the original game. You can see the difference in their um, penmanship. <laughs> totally fits their vibe. Oh wow. She even got a little tattoo. Well, we got a big one, but you know, they're vibey. They're vibey. I like it. We told <coughs> we told Rachel the truth. Oh no, we did we didn't tell Rachel the truth. It's fifty fifty. Holy shit! Wow. And now we got some cute clips at the end. They do not know what to do. <laughs> Oh, I remember the the photo booth uh, strip from the first game, original game too. It all tied together. Oh, fuck. I forgot about that. <laughs> now I'm sad. Oh. And if you guys did not watch 
my playthrough of the original game and you haven't seen the original game, go check it out on YouTube. Because that will make sense. All those things in the end will make sense. So, if you haven't seen it already, check it out. Um, we can do the farewell episode another time. Thank you for watching this series. And I will see you guys next year. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time.